All right, what's up guys? Um, I'm gonna title this video, Are BCM Uppers Worth It? Because I asked myself that. Um, I guess I probably should have had this sling off before. Um, I had to ask myself this many times. Um, before buying this, they, uh, I want to say this upper ran me close to 800 bucks because it's a 14.5. Uh, it's got a surefire muzzle brake that is, um, I don't know if you can see it, it's pinned and welded. But, so yeah, I uh, got this upper probably. probably about a year ago and like I said it was it was fairly expensive I know we all love uh, getting try not to slam that down getting uh, the Palmetto State uppers for next to nothing but there is truly a a quality difference in the BCM parts. They, everything is tested so thoroughly and that was one of the things that kind of really led me to wanting this. I couldn't find the target. I had a target from when I cited this EOTech. This is a, what is this, e EXPS2 that I got at the same time as the upper in the lower for that matter but um but yeah they uh it's a 14.5 barrel uh cold hammer forged i believe i can't remember chrome lined uh feed ramps and whatnot shoots really well it, uh, i mean i wish i could find that target i'd show you but I would say it was probably about a one inch group. I think I shot five rounds once I got this sighted in at a hundred. And that was just uh, some random 55 grain um, American Eagle. But yeah, this, uh, I really can truly say I really would support someone that wanted to buy this this upper or one of their rifles in general this is basically i mean this is a bcm rifle i just bought the parts separately and threw it on there uh let me put up this pin nice thing about your higher end ar stuff is you're not fighting the pins it's all real simple stuff here um, it's got their BCM full auto bolt, full auto rated. This doesn't make it full auto, <laughs> but really nice bolt. Um, trying to see, yeah, right there you can see HPMP. That is a P, right? Yeah, MP tested. No problems at all with this bolt. Uh, cleans up really nice. Let's go to. I like their uh, BCM gunfighter. Let me set it down. Gunfighter. Uh, what is this? Mod 3B, single side. I don't ever use the the right side of a charging handle, so might as well just stick with the one side. Really nice charging handle. This is a uh, this is their Mark II upper. If you notice, your forward assist is way up here. They took a bunch of this is lighter. I believe it's lighter, or it's the same weight as a a mil spec upper. But they took a bunch of weight out of like your forward assist. Same with your uh, deflector here. They put it in 
different spots that needed more more material in them. Um, so it's just a just a little bit, um, some, uh, a little more advanced upper. Uh, hit me in the knee, <laughs> but. Yeah, it's just a little bit more advanced. I mean, that's why it's Mark II. I guess you'd say a mil specs Mark One. So, um, handguard. Let's talk about this handguard. This is MCMR. It's a 13, 13 inch. It's a 14 and a half inch setup, pin and welded, 16 overall. Um. No complaints to Hangard. I mean, you can see the finish held up nice. The finish held up better than the finish on an EOTech, so. I just cleaned this gun recently, so it's got oils and stuff everywhere. But yeah, works fine for everything I use it for. Um, I'll make a little video on these here, these stream lights soon. Pretty nice. Pretty nice for the money. Um, I wanted to put a, a surefire on this, but money, it's all about money. Um, it's a gunfighter, uh, <clears throat> grip there, a little bit less of an angle than an A2, just nicer, feels better. Um, but yeah, trigger's nice, gun's empty. Trigger's pretty nice on here. You can see it's a BCM one. It's got the star there. But uh, it's got a little bit of take up. These are polished by them. But. Yeah, overall, I mean, things pretty nice. Uh, Is the issue here? <laughs> oh, there we go. I never cycled the bolt far enough. Felt like an idiot there. But you can see triggers polished. Nice break. I'll uh, do the reset for you. Overall, it's just a nice mil spec trigger. It's just cleaned up. Um, one of the things I like is they put their their uh, QD plate on there. Um, other than that, I mean, it's just a Magpul AFG there. You put anything on there, obviously, it's M-Lock. They got M-Lock all the way around it. Comes with their, uh, yeah, it's their cutie swivel but yeah other than that I mean I think BCM makes a hell of a rifle they make a hell of a part too but pairs well with the EOTech overall just a good shooter um, I mean I think you can depend on this rifle for the rest of time I guess I mean they're built, built really well Like a lot of their their stocks, their grips. BCM makes some nice stuff. Put it on uh, that little AR pistol that I've thrown together. But yeah, hopefully this helps you uh, finally break down and buy a BCM upper. <laughs> I know it was tough for me at first, but I'm really happy I did it, and it's just a nice nice piece all right leave a like let's uh hopefully get someone on here that needed to see this all right thanks